Hey everyone, it's Ness. Welcome back. Thanks for joining me for another video. Uh, let's get started. This was yesterday's spread that I did on my own because I had the sticker um, filling my sticker book video for today. Um, I tried um, after I did that to try to put these stickers in them. They're paper stickers and these just did not have very much stickiness to them. I mean, to the point where I had, I had to glue each one of these into my journal because they just weren't very sticky. Um, but I think it's so cute. So I ended up using like all, like the entire sheet just because I already had them off the sheet and I didn't want them to go to waste and I didn't want to lose them. So I was like, whatever, I'm just going to use the entire sheet on here. And actually like how it turned out lots of blues and purples and pinks and it's just so cute i love this little brave little toaster over here <laughs> um and this kitty donut super adorable um yeah so that's that one let's get into today uh pretty chill day well not really we did a lot <laughs> Um, we ended up watching two movies today, unintentional, but I forgot that we already had plans to go see Venom 3 tonight, and yeah, I ended up buying tickets for Heretic, so we went to go see both, and yeah, it was like a double feature type of thing, which I like, because that's what I used to do with my mom growing up. We used to go watch two movies for the day or even sometimes three movies just because we really liked movies um i'm just gonna i cut these in half so that way i can uh put them in here glue them in here better than i could with like folding it especially since this paper is a little bit thicker so the kid went off to school and Johnny and I went to go see Heretic, which I was really excited to go see, but I think I was expecting um, a little bit more suspense. <laughs> it wasn't terrible, um, it wasn't bad, but it just wasn't as like thrilling as I thought it would be. Um, so yeah. Not definitely. I'm I'm gonna be perfectly fine falling asleep today, even if I was alone, cause it just wasn't very scary. Uh, should we put this like smack dab in the middle? I never do that, unless it's like one of those like fruit tart thingies. But let's put it smack dab in the middle. I accidentally left my glue stick open all day yesterday from like nine o'clock in the morning to nine at night and that's why it's acting like a little bit more difficult so this is not a true representation of this glue stick it is because i am a horrible stationary owner and i let it dry out i was going to I, don't, I mean, I don't really know how to rehydrate a glue stick, but I was thinking I was going to um, maybe add some like spray with water. I don't know if that would actually even work, but I ended up closing it last night when I realized what I had done and it ended up getting sticky again. So if I'm trying to use it for today instead of my liquid one just to try and like break through that layer that was dried out by me and see if I can fix it fully because shame on me, shame on me. Uh, do you want this up here or down here? Let's put it up here so it's like a line of memos. Okay, <coughs> excuse me. So, Heretic, not too bad. Um, expected a little bit more, 
but it is kind of cool to see like Hugh Grant in that kind of way um just because you know you don't really see him as like the bad guy in movies well I, I should take that back he was kind of bad in the D&D movie so wait like this was a different level um so yeah we went to go see that and then <laughs> Uh, we were trying to like kill time after so we went to a smart and final <laughs> in uh, the other city that's close to us to try to find that Tommy's chili because I was like okay we need something to do between like now and having to pick the kid from school and we didn't really want to go back home um, we just I don't know it was like a weird amount of time that we had so we were originally gonna go to Costco my absolute favorite store to go to um, but when we got there it was like a madhouse it was so busy normally we can find parking no problem but there, there was like nothing there's nothing so we're like okay forget it let's go to smart and final because it was like a little bit away from Costco and try to find that chili. We walked all around the store, couldn't find it, which is such a shame because I really wanted it. And um, then I was like, okay, I want to go to Michael's um, because every year we do a every year we do a gingerbread house and you know we never eat it we actually always forget to eat it or like to pick it out pick at it or whatever um but we usually decorate one side each and yeah like take pictures of every side um but this year i thought it'd be kind of neat to buy like these wooden gingerbread houses that they sell at Michael's um, and paint them brown and then use puffy paint to do like the icing and stuff and maybe buy some like fake candies and stuff. That way we can have it every year. But they didn't have them out at my Michael's so that was lame. I saw a reel for it and I was like, I really like that idea. Maybe we should do that instead because we spend so much money on like candy and then the gingerbread house and then the icing is so bad and we're always like struggling for everything to like stay together and yeah. So it's like, okay, maybe we can do this instead and have like a keepsake for the year and you know like grow on it maybe like create a gingerbread village where we just add on a new gingerbread house every year so maybe we just gotta wait a little bit longer for some gingerbread house houses to come out because they had like nutcrackers um and Mm, they had like ceramic ones, ceramic gingerbread houses, but I want the wood ones just so that way we don't have to worry about like cracking them or anything like that. So, um, so that was a bust. And then because I was so sad about not being able to find that chili, I was like, let's go get some Tommy's French fries. <laughs> so, and it's like right next to Michael's too. So we went to get some Tommy's fries and they were delicious. They were so delicious. Um, and then after that, we went to go pick up the kid and we went home for a little bit cause we had some time in between picking him up and going to the movies again. Oh yeah, at Smart Final, we did grab this like huge jug of <laughs> ranch. We just bought a huge jug of ranch. 
um, because you know it's always hard to find like a good ranch you know like restaurant style ranch where it, it doesn't taste I don't know like off ah. like I want that Wingstop ranch you know it's just yummy um, so I was like I want to try this ranch to see if it's actually good or not and so we bought the ranch well actually first we accidentally grabbed um we grabbed blue cheese and i am not a fan of blue cheese <laughs> at all i do not like it and yeah it's just not my my cup of tea I always try it every so often to see if maybe, maybe things will change. Maybe I'll like it, but I have not had the change to my taste buds yet. So um, we almost made that fatal mistake of purchasing blue cheese when we didn't mean to. And thankfully I caught it right when we were checking out. And then Johnny ran to go get, to like go swap it out with some ranch. So, got a huge tub of ranch and, uh, and I think some crackers too. Smart Final actually has some pretty good stuff. Like, you know, that you can get huge tubs of thrifty ice cream. I don't mean like, you know, like how at Walmart you can get like the plastic tubs of like ice cream. Um, it's like the actual tubs of ice cream that they use at Thrifty to scoop and like sell you like an ice cream cone. I was like, oh my gosh, that's so crazy. I want one of those. I mean, obviously I do not have room for it, but man, if they had mint chip, I think I would have purchased a huge thing of mitten chip and bought some cones and just went to town on that baby but yeah they didn't have mitten chip which was super disappointing they did have rainbow and that was my favorite as a kid i really loved rainbow ice cream um but i don't think i could down an entire thing of rainbow ice cream on my own or sherbet rainbow sherbet um so i would have to get something that is liked by all i want to put this little guy somewhere i just like how colorful it is with like this cake this is so pretty i got this from cute things from japan very pretty um so yeah if you ever need a massive tub of um, ice cream and you like thrifty ice cream like I like thrifty ice cream then you can get those huge tubs of them they had sherbet vanilla strawberry chocolate mm -hmm. and they had a caramel swirl one uh, they, they were they were tempting they were tempting <laughs> um let's see what do we want what do we want we want something here maybe something going down as well and then like let's just fill in like all of these extra little spaces because there is a ton of room to write so yeah so after we wasted some time at home we ended up going to the movies and uh, got some popcorn, some candy, some drinks, and headed on in. Um, and it was, I feel like I liked the Venom 3 movie more than I liked the Heretic movie. But maybe, maybe it's because I just had really, really high expectations for Heretic. And I had zero expectations or like, mm, I don't know. It's like, I uh, I feel like I know what I'm getting when I go and watch a Venom movie, right? It's like going to see like a Transformers movie or like 
an action flick. I know, like, I'm, I know what I'm going to get. And, but I was expecting a lot from the Heretic movie. And, yeah, I think Smile 2 was was better if you want to be scared <laughs> um which is funny because i was such a chicken with that last the other night um but i don't know it was just i think it was more enjoyable feeling like the edge of being on the edge of your seat in smile 2 and questioning so many things in smile 2 compared to heretic there was like really no suspenseful moments um like that you want to feel when you go watch a scary movie I don't know let me know what you think if you if you went to go see it I would love to know what you thought of the movie um or if it's just me that's thinking these things <laughs> and uh maybe I'm wrong I don't know that, that, that's how I felt about the movie. It's It wasn't bad. It wasn't bad at all, but uh, just expecting a little bit more more suspense, more thriller. Um, so yeah, we just got home from watching Venom. And I decided I should probably journal because I haven't had all morning to journal uh, just because we were just constantly doing something, which is nice. I, I like that um, at times, right? Like, it, I know this is our kind of recharge weekend, but I still like to do stuff with boys um, where it's just like us. Ah, so cute. I love these. These things are going to go by so fast just because I've been using them like crazy. Okay, so we need something for on top of here, right? 100%, maybe something super colorful. Ooh, this guy escaped. Um, yeah, we need something super colorful for on top of that uh, calendar sticker. Oh my gosh, I almost, I, I feel like I've been forgetting this every single day. And now that I think about it, I, I know I have been. Maybe, let me see. Yep, mm. yep, 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 yep. Oh no, yes, I have been. I've been forgetting it for days. Uh, I forgot it here too. What is wrong with me? Here? Oh no. Okay. Well, <laughs> I had it stacked underneath like all of the advent calendar folders and it just completely slipped my mind. So, uh, it's okay. We can just start doing it again. So, we need eights. Eight, eight, eight. I think I like this one because it's super rainbowy and pretty and bring some color to the page some more color because we need all the colors this one's really cute too but i think i like this shaved ice one and we can put him here because he's so cute all right we fix that and oops we need something for right here, and then we can be done. Let's go to the back. Look at how pretty everything is. I love it. Hmm. He's cute. What should we put? Let's put... Oh, these are gorgeous. Oh, should we put a brain? Mm -hmm. Let's see, maybe we should use these guys first <laughs> so they don't get lost in the back. Oh, these are cute too. Ooh, I wanna use a bunny. 
Oh, these are cute. They're all cute. They're all cute. Mm. Okay. I know I wanted to use one of the older ones, but these bunny ones are just like calling my name. And I want to use this one right here. Oh, I'm shedding everywhere. Because they're so sweet. Look at them sleeping. Okay, I think that is pretty good. These paper ones stuck very nicely. I think these were like ultra sticky. So if you want to put some of the advent stickers in here, these held on very nicely. Just those ones that I used yesterday, those did not want to stick, but I also had to use glue for them to make them stick in my journal. So, uh, let's do this guy because you know what? Venom 3 had some scientists in it, so we can go with this cutie. <laughs> Just so we can add another sticker, because why not? We need all of the stickers. And then we totally need some like highlighter pink for this, which is this. And yesterday I did like pretty swirls. So I kind of want to do that again. And it was like really relaxing to do. I'm gonna go to Daiso tomorrow and I'm so excited. Um, Anita Budgets on YouTube and Instagram said that she went and they had um, Christmas stuff out. So I want to check out the Daiso that's closest to me. It's still kind of far um, to see if they have the Christmas stuff because I would love to get some Christmas stickers because yeah I don't really have any besides I think maybe the bunny stickers that were in the advent sticker sticky club set but those feel like more wintry and I can't remember if the monthly sets had any Christmas stuff I usually just glance at those and then try and forget about them so that way um, it can be like a real surprise. Like I usually just look at them really quickly so that way I can decide which ones I want to commit to for the month. And I, I mean, I, for, I forgot to, I forgot to only just get the cute one. <laughs> so I'm getting all three this month and I don't, I don't remember what's in any of them. So it'll be a total surprise. All right, I think that's pretty good. Um, but yeah, I think that is it for this decorating portion in my journal. I hope you enjoyed watching. And if you like these kinds of videos and you'd like to, sub and you'd like to see more, subscribe. I put out a video every single day so you always have something to watch with like, I mean, if you like this kind of like aesthetic of cutesiness and kitties and animals and color. Um, well, yeah, I hope you have a really great start to your weekend and I will see you in the next one. All right. Bye.